All right, so do you remember the first time you tried a new activity growing up? It's exciting, but of course it comes with a learning curve. Yeah, and a middle school student in Murfreesboro decided last school year that she wanted to play the drums. She tells News Channel 5's Austin Pollock nothing was going to get in her way. The Sobe household in Murfreesboro can be quite loud. It can be for sure, yeah. <laughs> but 12 year old Aubrey refuses to keep quiet. She just does whatever she wants to do. I'm really into music. I can just lay down and listen to any genre of music and it makes me feel happy. There's so much resiliency there that she has never known any different. So she just does things how she does things. One of the things that impresses me most about Aubrey is not only how she plays the drums, but rather how she handles what can make middle school so tough. A lot of kids making fun of me. Aubrey was born a triple congenital amputee. Yeah, a lot of people are very rude. Like, it's primarily kids. Sometimes they come up to me and just start touching my arms. So I'm just, whoa. We have always looked for resources. We have had lots of support and help. My program is called Tech Engineering for Kids. Dr. Steve Canfield is an engineering professor at Tennessee Tech. His students fitted Aubrey for these prosthetics. Now these are custom designed. I mean, they scanned her arms, made many versions to custom fit her. Aubrey's band instructors were able to help make the connection to the student engineers at Tennessee Tech. It helps. There's no question about that. And Aubrey has clearly found her way. impressive, right? Well, listen to Aubrey loud and clear. People look at me and be like, I bet she wasn't, isn't able to do anything, but I can do everything. So it doesn't really bother me. I'm Austin Pollock, News Channel 5.